We couldn't have asked for a better sports week between many tournaments and football games. Plus, the NFL is back. We're just on cloud nine right now. But just like any other Sunday, you know we have to break down the QMG play of the week. This week's winner is from Cardinals country, Sal Shelby's Preston Ellison. Watch Preston hit the B button, spinning out from the defender and taking it all the way to the end zone for the touchdown. Sal Shelby has always been stacked with running backs and clearly it continues into this season. Now let's take a look at this week's nominees. We got Illini West, Isaiah Knotts, finding the gap, running up the middle and taking off all the way to the end zone for a 50 yard plus rushing touchdown. Offensive line did a really great job on this play, just opening the gap for Isaiah to take off and it paid off big time there. Sticking with high school football, here's Quincy High's Tykel Hammers, weaving in and out of traffic. This man is too fast and too quick. He takes it all the way to the end zone for a 46 yard touchdown. And look at his celebration at the end. He knows he's that guy. Let's switch over to on uh, the soccer pitch now. Hannibal Highs, Chase Askey scoring a beautiful goal right here. I always say in soccer, goals are not easy to come by, but this one was perfect just off the top. That was a great kick. Let's switch over to volleyball now. We got Rushville's Italy Ford diving for the dig to keep the play alive for the Rockets. Watch this, just sacrificing her body, keeping the play alive. That was an awesome play right there. We'll go to the softball dirt for our last and final nominee. Here's Palmyra's Avery Wisehart with bases loaded. She swings and sends this ball right over the fence for the three run homer. That was an awesome play there by Avery. Those are your QMG nominees. So as always, be sure to log on to WGM.com sports and cast your vote.